Johnson is now part of a historic group of leaders in Milwaukee. 12 News' Jaron Jordan reports that group represents a younger and more diverse generation. As the first elected black person sworn in as mayor in Milwaukee's history, Cavalier Johnson joins an historic group of black men chosen to lead. Now we have an opportunity for those folks who've lived and have lived, lived experience in the most depressed parts of our city having the opportunity to be at the decision making table. Johnson joins Milwaukee Police Chief Jeffrey Norman, Milwaukee County Executive David Crowley, Sheriff Ernell Lucas, and the Superintendent of Milwaukee Public Schools, Dr. Keith Posley. This is an opportunity where a young person in Milwaukee Public Schools can look up and say, I could become the mayor of the city of Milwaukee, I could become the county executive, I could become the police chief, I could become the sheriff, the superintendent of schools, doctor, lawyer, you name it. This is a golden opportunity for young people and for individuals to be able to dream big dreams. We want people to know that when you come up and you show up, uh, your voice matters and it is being heard. Also making herstory, Milwaukee's chairwoman of the Board of Supervisors, Marcelia Nicholson, the first black and Latina woman to hold the position. Coming from 53206 with the county executive and the mayor means we're indicative of the people that we serve and represent. We look like them and we understand their needs. And so I think this is a real opportunity to get at the root of a lot of our issues and really take us uh, into a new era. These diverse leaders showing how far the city has come and offering a glimpse into what's possible for future generations. In Milwaukee, I'm Jaron Jordan, WISN 12 News. Mayor Johnson will serve the remaining two years of the previous mayor's term. He said he plans to run again in two years. And he